Hello everyone, my name is Apache, and today we will be doing a Christmas special, opening all of the cards that I got from Christmas, and I had even bought myself some cards, which we'll get over all of what I bought and what I got for Christmas. So the first things that I bought would be this Pokeball. I've always wanted one of these, and I recently got back into collecting Pokemon cards. I sold my old collection. Uh, so everything that we are seeing right now is pretty much all brand new to my collection. Um, I have maybe a total of three, five, th anywhere from three to five hundred cards. Uh, it's not that big of a collection anymore, but I also bought uh, this tin as well. I love the artwork for Eevee and Snorlax. That was one of the biggest reasons why I got it. Uh, Eevee is one of my favorite Pokemon, but the cards that I got for Christmas was this booster pack. Really was not expecting this. Uh, so we'll definitely do two parts for this. Uh, I'll actually probably have to split this up into three different parts and do the booster pack in two different parts uh, separate from this video. Then I got this... Uh, I believe it's a deck. I don't usually do decks, so I'm unsure of that. Uh, and I also got these Dollar Tree uh, cards, which I've heard these Dollar Tree cards are some of the best packs to open if you are looking for some holographics or some rares. So we'll start off with uh, these Dollar Tree cards, and we'll see what we got from them. I haven't opened any of these cards, so I have no idea what's in them. Uh, but it looks like we got Gumi, Snover, and and Zelf. And unfortunately, the extra cards don't have codes in them. So we'll get to the whole codes part section here in a minute when I I guess start pulling cards that have the code cards in them anyways for the second pack I got Hallnard or something like that I don't know how to pronounce a lot of these I got a lavender town uh, trainer card and a energy card so we'll put this reverse hollow aside for now. Just because since I am still new to these, I'm going to do a larger recap than what a lot of other uh, larger YouTubers do. So this channel will be partnered with somebody who goes by the name Zazelic. Or the alias Zazelic. And he'll be opening some uh, Yu-Gi-Oh card packs for us, so it'll be a mixture between a Pokemon card opening and a, oh, um, I got a Scissor GX card, so we'll definitely set that one aside, but, uh, I got the Rainbow Bush brush as well as that Trico. Uh, anyways, It'll be a mixture between Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon cards, so um, I can't wait to see everybody's reaction to a dual card opening channel. I haven't seen one, uh, but I'm sure they do exist. And for my last Dollar Tree pack, we got Yamask, a Dust Ox, which I'll set that aside since it's a Reverse Hollow, and a Xantu. So now I think I'll head on over to uh, this. Still not certain if it's a deck. I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, it's a themed deck. I don't usually look at these. I usually always go for the tens. So I don't typically 
know what the others are. Try not to destroy the packaging too much because I kind of want to keep it. Hopefully we can pull out some more GX cards, but here is a code, and this is the Kyogre that was in the front of it. The artwork doesn't look too bad. I don't like how his fin up here is really close to the edge of the artwork. I wish there was a little, it was back just a little bit further, but other than that, it's really not that bad of artwork. So now we'll get into the deck itself. I don't know what the decks contain. Uh, so if somebody can comment and let me know what these decks contain, that would be nice. Because I know they have quite a few energy cards usually. But um, outside of that, I don't know if they have like any a chance of having any GX cards or anything of that sort. And it would be nice to know if... I have a chance of pulling anything rare from these, or if they're all just regular cards. So I do need a bit, a bit of a refresher on Pokemon in itself, just because it's been a while since, so I don't know any error cards or what's really considered rare outside of the secret rares or anything like that. Um, it's been a while since I've collected Pokemon cards. So, if anybody has the knowledge that they'd love to share with me, I would gladly appreciate it because um, I really don't know a whole lot about uh, the newer, newer Pokemon cards. I'm going to set this deck off to the side because it keeps sliding off. Looks like I got another Kyogre card. Which is actually pretty interesting because I wasn't expecting... ...to pull another one, so I'm going to just set that one. Actually, no, I'm going to put that in with the others. And it doesn't look like I got anything too rare. It might have been that Kyogre that I just pulled. That was probably the only rare that was in it. Um, but again, if anybody could let me know what's inside of those decks and if they're worth continuing to get an opening, uh, I'd gladly appreciate it. So next we'll be opening this tin. The one that has the artwork for Eevee and Snorlax. That's a really good artwork. I really like that. Uh, from afar, it does kind of look like Snorlax eating a Pokemon. But I'm sure those are just berries. As far as our card channel goes, the Zillok and Ice card channel goes, I am not too certain uh, for... I'm going to put this back here. I'm not too certain for um, how often we're going to do card openings. I'd like to try to do at least a card a day. Or an opening a day. But I understand that money is involved in this. So I'm not too sure how far we'll get into that. I thought about saving that booster pack for part of that card a day thing, but again, I am uncertain about the whole, how often we're going to be uploading card is. There's another code. I'm going to go ahead and throw those back there since I don't need them anymore. And these are the four packs I was able to get. I guess here's two of them and then there's the other two. 
think I'm going to open this one first. Just because it's my least favorite artwork, I'm going to go with the my favorite artwork for last. Uh, and also I will be partnering up with somebody who is going to here is another code who's going to uh, allow me to uh, he's basically going to sponsor us uh, he's going to allow me to open cards for him He's owns a comic book shop and he gets Pokemon cards in all the time. And he's going to allow me to open those up for free. Uh, but I have to give all the cards back to him. So I'll let you guys know which cards uh, I do open for him. So that way they're not included in my collection. Anyways, it looks like I got something good in this deck already. Uh, but let's go ahead and skim through these. I got a Manti. I really like that artwork for Manti, actually. I've got a Marie, a Wormpole, Jigglypuff, and a little informed Meowth. And then whatever this is. I actually don't know exactly what this is. Looks pretty cool. I don't know if that's just a regular hollow foil or what exactly but if somebody could let me know the rarity of this card that would be great and not like if it's extremely hard to pull or something like that just like uh, I know it's not a secret rare um, I know that there's a diamond here but I don't know if it's like a GX card or something like that um, I definitely can't wait to get refreshed on what these cards are I uh, will go ahead and open this pack up next Again, going with my least favorite artworks first. There's that code. Got a Hitmonlee. Charmander, a Manic P, a Volpix, a Pancham, another one of these cards, which is, they're just interesting to me because I don't know what they are, and it looks like I got a Zapdos as well, sorry about that, it looks like my camera might have moved. And there's that one, if you guys didn't get to see that one. So I'm going to save this one for last just because I really like the Eevee and Starlux combination. I don't know why. It seems like a really good combination to me. And then the, our next opening will be that Pokeball, and then we'll save that booster pack for another day. Alright, and here's that code. And I love the Evolutions set just because it's the older set. But I don't know who won for those who collected the old, really old Pokemon cards. I got a Poliwhirl, Ratatat, a Weedle, Voltorb, Poliwag, Ghastly, a Reverse Mewtwo, which I'll set that with my other Reverse cards, and then a Rare Dugong.
which I will be getting a lot more Pokemon cards here soon. My collection is definitely going to go up, and I guess everybody gets to basically uh, see my uh, card collection go up from the start. Uh, I will do a video showing what cards I have now. Uh, it's not very many. I have them over here in uh, this binder. Uh, but... Yeah. Must that one up just a little bit, but that's fine. Here is another code. I got a Hitmonlee, Dana, Kabuto, Vishini, uh, Zora, Psyduck, Emulga. A star you and a little geo dude and then this skymary which will set that hollow off to the side or the reverse hollow and next is the pokeball I'm not entirely sure what these contain it says three booster packs and one coin which I do feel is a bit of a waste because the tens are like twenty dollars and so are these pokeballs but the regular tens are they give you four packs instead of three unless if things have changed and I just wasn't paying attention but as far as I'm aware the tens are still twenty dollars and they give you four booster packs in them but I do understand that People, are, there's going to be a bit more of a demand for these Pokeballs because people are going to flock over them. I was honestly hoping that you had to push the button and it would open up that way. But that's not how it works. This is the coin I got. I don't know if my camera is going to pick that up very well or not. It looks like it's... A Rapidash or a Ponyta. But these are the packs that I got out of it. Nothing that really piques my interest. I really like the Evolution packs, so I really hope to get those. But, I'm okay with whatever for now. There's that other code. Starting off, I got a Vaporeon, a Gloom, a Gumi, Inky. A Boltoy, Persian, the Gorlo Golark or something like that, a Quagsir, and then a regular rare Reggie Ice. There's our other code, and I, we'll only have one more code after these. I pulled a... Sorry. Starvey, or something like that. A Grump Pig, a Q-Bone, Feebass. Land it a pumpkaboo, pork fish, a care blast, which that was the reverse, so I'm gonna set it over there. A gorgeous or something like that, and then 
I must have pulled this wrong. But still really, really happy about that uh, Scissor GX I got. It's one that I got from uh, the Dollar Tree card. So I really wasn't expecting to get anything from this. And I was able to pull a GX off of them. So this is our last pack for this video. And our last code. I got a Summer Sage, Royal Peed, Pikachu, a Pansteer, Charmander, an Alolan Form, Ratatat, Porygon, a Reverse Hollow uh, Trainer card, and then a regular rare uh, Tortontor or something like that. Uh, but the, actually, we need to do our recap. So, I got this. I don't know what these are called, but I got the Shaman and then another one of these. Uh, Lucid Mine. I got the two cards. I got this promo card from that tin that I opened. Really love the artwork on this one. Um, Again, from afar, it does look like Snorlax is eating a Pokemon. Almost looks like he's eating an Eevee. Uh, but I know that they're just berries. Uh, I really like the style of artwork. Uh, not too sure why. Uh, I hope they continue with this type of artwork. But um, I also got this Kyogre that I got from the deck. And then this uh, Sizer. Which, uh, this card actually kind of just goes to show that the Dollar Tree cards are really good to go with. I only had four packs, so that's four dollars, and I got this GX card from the four dollars. Um, I did do another larger opening of these cards, or the Dollar Tree cards, a while ago, and they do seem to do really well with um, your... At that time, they were full art cards, and... Um, just your other stuff but anyways uh, stay tuned and we will get to this booster pack uh, probably within the next couple of days uh, but for now that'll be all so thanks for watching don't forget to get, leave a like uh, leave a comment and subscribe for more content